and inner world of DCS today. High G, high vodka maneuvers. Small boat. Big boat. Got it! <laughs> Got it! <laughs> and the train interrupts an act of war again. Say money can't buy happiness. Look at that fucking smile on my face. Welcome to second episode of 47 Gear. And before we get back to finding out where SU-25 can beat these democracy filled boys, it's time to get a bit down to earth. And when I say down to earth, I mean this. If you want some chalky milk from a suspicious Belgium snake, while fighter jet provides certainly good means of closing a distance to this dealer of chalky milk, you might find difficulty with the parking. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Meanwhile in the Humvee, EA Sports, it's in the game. Look at this distinguished gentleman. And if you add the fact that locals, who are not very patient, might disassemble your plane faster than a Ukrainian special commander. <laughs> Iceberg dead ahead. One might consider this hammer to be a decent option, but is that so? Well, let's take a look inside. The interior doesn't have many features. You won't find airbags, air conditioning, gear lever, or a speedometer. And somehow, people who created this wheel also uninvented the circle and replaced it with more rectangular type. Look at this distinguished gentleman! His name is Surgeon Jeff Pickleson. But he did not answer me whether both parents were pickles or just one, so might just be half a pickle. But he's in peaceful mood, because we are not in the Middle East. But he would certainly tell you that you should have seen him in the Middle East. He killed so many bad guys that the terrorist activity dropped by 90%. <laughs> not because he killed all terrorists. He actually didn't kill any. But he killed everyone else, including passenger plane, he shot down. So many terrorists were left jobless. Let's do a boring speed test first, because one can never be too boring. Well actually, just to spice it up a little, let's add a song into the foreground. When I saw communist I shot him with my wrist, and then he died, and asked if I would spare the Estalabist, good lord Jesus Christ. Then the Stalin and his buddies came to hunt me down, but I just gave them some jerky, and told them to sit down. When I explained that it's just boring being communism they all found out that sometimes it's abysm. Abysm, like, communism. When the Stalin finally got rid of every ism, mind you also that pesky capitalism. World became a much worse place for what no man could ever find a phrase. You got to find a place where every Jeff is hunted then maybe then you will find that you actually love it. After all the wars took away our planes let's just start a hotel just to provide some place where the turbines and rammers find their home maybe even propellers will get their own, their own. Just like with a socialism there is no need for money, since death and destruction will give us the honey, the honey. This highly scientific test brings us up to 112 km per hour, which is a good reminder who you should call if you see a Humvee moving this fast. I can see a Humvee. Shut up and breathe. I think I shot my one and drive it every day to work. I have suddenly forgot first aid. It looks 
しないと谷底へ真っ逆さまだぞ言わんとじゃねえ好きっとが乗りすぎてるぞ立て直して減速するスペースはもうねえコンセントレッサービー、プリーズ、ミディアムレフト、ロング、ロング、ロング、ロング、トゥーネン、ミディアムレフト、ミディアムレフト、ミディアムレフト、ナイスニーズ、トゥーン、トロトル、カース、ミディアムレフト、ロング、ロング、イン、イン。Wait, wait, wait, no, 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 no. It means bear right. No. Up there. It said right, so take a right. No, this is my life! Stop yelling at me! No, it's not your life! Good Lord Jesus Christ. So that's for the Humvee. The usefulness of this review is questionable. Perhaps it's worse at its purpose than a chair with one leg. But since no one ever reviewed Humvee in DCS, it's the best review of Humvee ever. In DCS, of course. That's the important bit. But now, let's get back to answering question that we have not managed to answer in the first episode of 47 Gear. And that is whether a Su-25 can beat the best from the West, in form of Australian, USS Iowa, British TAC with Boris Johnson inside, we're working with more than 25 allies and partners from as far away as Australia to support those engaged in the battle, not only to protect their homes, but T and T itself. And a Sherman <laughs> stolen from a memorial in Bastogne. Well, about the USS Iowa, you might wonder how I solved its unsinkability, and I solved it by simply not inviting them into the war. Instead, a bunch of Australians on speedboats showed up. In general, this is more fitting and immersion increasing. Give him a little friend. Everybody needs a friend. Because I don't know any better, here is what happened. Underlined with some cheeky orchestra music. I'm 
How'd that happen? It didn't even give me a chance. How did I die? So for those unaware, your head is out here for like a third of a second. And he didn't actually shoot at me. So um, he shoots at center mass. So he's missing here. He's missing his target because it's a shotgun, but he's happening to graze the top of my head here. So to, to, to explain this all, um, my head is here for about a third of a second. He has to miss. And see see how high this is? It's about as low as he can possibly shoot. The, the pixel perfectness of this, you won't see this for the rest of your life. This is so pixel perfect that there's no reason to change his strategy. This will never happen again. I don't think you have any idea how fast I really am. I'm fast as fuck. I saw this boat in half. There's the worst possible thing that could have occurred. I'm actually dead. Ah, no. All this because I shot that first guy perfectly and he didn't die. Olympic target. Oh yeah. The the pixel perfectness of this, you won't see this for the rest of your life.